We often hear about the effects of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, but carbon dioxide is a naturally occurring and vital component of the atmosphere. The problems occur when we have too much carbon dioxide. I've got a little experiment here to show you the effects of increased carbon dioxide. What I have here is two bottles, and what I've done is I've put a temperature probe in each. What I want to do now is introduce some more carbon dioxide into this bottle. So this bottle will be normal atmospheric air, and this bottle will be atmospheric air with a greater concentration of carbon dioxide. Now, first of all, I need to make my carbon dioxide. And carbon dioxide can be made very simply by taking sort of good old vinegar and mixing it with some uh, bicarbonate of soda. And as I add, you can see it's all fizzing up. Now what I want to do is I want to put this hose in the bottle and capture that carbon dioxide and feed it into this bottle. So in this setup, I need to have something that represents the sun. Now, I can't bring a sun into the laboratory here, but what I'm going to do instead is use these two lamps. Now, at the start of the experiment, I've got about the same temperature in each of the bottles, but what I want to do is turn on the lamps and get, have that energy pumping into the two bottles, and hopefully I should get an increased temperature rise in the bottle with the carbon dioxide more than the bottle with the normal atmospheric air. So let's give it a go. So while we're waiting for the reaction to take place, what effect does carbon dioxide in the atmosphere actually have? Well, if we look at planet Earth, energy is coming in from the sun into the atmosphere. Now, some of that energy penetrates through the Earth's atmosphere and is reflected off the surface. Now, that surface reflection comes out as infrared or heat energy. Now, the carbon dioxide molecule is particularly susceptible to that heat energy, and it absorbs the radiation and then re-radiates it, and this increases the temperature of planet Earth. So this experiment has been running for a few minutes now, and we can actually start seeing the effects that the carbon dioxide has on the atmosphere. And here we have a change of about five degrees more in the bottle with the carbon dioxide. This is a very simple experiment showing the effects that carbon dioxide have on the atmosphere. But there are other gases that have similar effect, like methane and water vapour, and they're collectively known as the greenhouse gases. So this is a simple experiment showing the greenhouse effect, but in a bottle.